Hey guys, I thought I would film a little bit today because I am just cleaning my house. Actually, Jordan just left my house yesterday, Jordan Hans. And if you guys follow me on Snapchat, you would have known that she came and we filmed some Halloween videos together. Jesus loves Christy. What are you doing, Jordan? Just sleeping. <laughs> Spray paint. <laughs> yes, Christy loves you. She's spray painting her legs. Ah! Ah! Asked Jordan if she wanted me to do her back. She thought it was completely done. Turn around. <laughs> well, you got it, right? Okay, it seems like you're making Christy fun of my butt. Has a little butt crack, and I'm gonna tell her. It's very small. It starts very low down. It's but teens. It's a little teens. Texturize, bro. I'm getting your old texture, bro. Texturize me, bro. Yeah, what are you gonna get for? Little double fist and texture. Oh, texturize oh, my oh, vagina. Oh! oh. <laughs> the lengths we go to to please you people. If we didn't know. <laughs> <laughs> We've had this plan for a couple of months now and I'm so glad that it's finally happened and we got some amazing videos done. You guys are gonna die when you see them. They are so good. I am so proud of the stuff that we just did over the last few days and I hope you guys love it as much as I do. It's all gonna be really good. But my house is a shit show because when you are doing Hi Googly Bear. Hi Googly Hello. Look. Look. When you're doing Halloween videos and prepping and filming and all of that stuff over the course of like five days, weirdly enough, you don't have much time to clean. <laughs> and I think what I'm gonna do right now is I'm just gonna clean the house. And I thought I would chat with you guys a little bit. I've been watching Peter Mon all morning, who, if you don't know who he is, I just love him. His humor is fantastic. And I just, I think the way he gets off on these tangents is wonderful. And it's funny because he actually made a video about me and it was called Robbie Beauty Christie Exposed. And I was like, Okay, my life's over. But it actually ended up being a really, really nice video and I was super fucking stoked because, you know, you see a video like that and it makes you want to die a little bit, but I didn't. And it was so good. And I actually really started liking Peter now because he's just, I just like him, I think maybe too, because he's a little bit older and he has different insights on things. I find that the older I get, the more I care less about stuff. And I still can talk about stuff, but I just don't care as much, which I actually really like. Oh my God, the amount of dishes is unsealed. I think we'll come back to the kitchen. I think we're gonna do the living room right now. Oh, speaking of kitchen, I wanna remodel it so bad if you can see it. These like bars and like this weird thing that sticks out. Oh my God. Here's the living room. Here I am, not wearing a bra. But that's okay. I'm gonna turn the light on and we're just gonna chat while I clean. We got some really good videos done, like really good. You guys are really gonna like them. They are probably, not even probably, they are like three of the best videos I've ever done. And it was so fun. As much as we wanted to die a little bit filming, ah, we also had such a good time. I wish she could have stayed even longer because we were filming the entire time. Okay, so living room is officially clean enough. It's not perfect, but what are you gonna do? And I just got a package at the door and I'm gonna open it. I figure I might as well open it on camera, eh? So it is from Mac and it is Nikki. I guess that says Nikki Minaj. Oh, so no, 
just 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 hush so this is the box that came oh wait is there a drawer oh my goodness look at this i'm excited to be back with mac and i can't wait for you to try my two new nude lipsticks i created for this fall my first products and many more to come with the brand show me how you rock my shades nikki's nude in the print pink print using mac x nikki minaj it's almost as if i've never read in my life oh look so there's like a lipstick ball oh, cool and then two shades that Nikki came out with, and obviously, she's looking like a fox. Ow. Well, thank you so much, Mac. I get so excited. How, what a cool package, and what a cool PR looking box. I really like this. That's probably one of the cooler PR packages I've gotten. I just think that is so neat looking. Oh, that's not the best lighting, is it? What? She has been so bad these last few days. No, last few weeks. You guys will hear her in this video like 87,000 times. I don't know what has happened to my cat, but she has lost her mind. I brought her to the vet. She's fine. Like, she's fine. But the problem is she's meowing all night long. Like, initially we thought it was thyroid because she was being so psycho, and I guess cats be psycho when they have thyroid disease. No. I mean, I can't say anything else other than she wakes me up at least eight times a night screaming, and and I'm turning on screaming like, meow, meow to the point where she wants up on the bed. If I don't let her up on the bed, which sometimes I don't, I don't even notice it because I'm so used to it at this point. She goes in the hallway. <laughs> like she is, you would think she was being murdered. And I don't know why it just started in the last like three weeks. Like she's always been really fucking annoying, but this is next level. I don't sleep at night because of her. Huh, mother? Like just hanging out on the edge of the table. What? Just being a mother. What's happened to you? What? What about that boy right there? Are you the cutest boy? Are you a sun bear? If you aren't just the cutest thing I ever did see. Mother. You're a cute boy. Her name's not Mother, by the way. It's Snickers. But for some reason, I can't quit calling her Mother. I don't know what that is. Yeah, I know. I see? The thing is, you're deaf. And I don't know what to do for you, my sweet. You got some eye goobies and I want to get them. What? What do you want? Help me help you. I'll do anything for you. You just have to, just, just, I love you. Whoa, what is she being a silly girl? Hey, <laughs> what are you doing? Oh my goodness, you're being a silly girl. Ow! I told you guys she's lost her mind. Oh, ow! <laughs> so I don't know what the rest of the plan for today is. I think I'm gonna start editing some Halloween videos. Wow, it looks like I'm very small in this chair. Halloween starts in like 10 days, um, and I have only filmed three videos, and I've got 15 to do. So I really gotta get cracking. Um, I think I have like 11 videos planned out, but I'm not 100% sure on them. So I think that's why I've been so MIA from like Snapchat. And yeah, I've been prepping for Halloween, and oh my gosh, <laughs> crazy. <coughs> and then as far as beauty videos and stuff like that go, I really don't know if there's any like new collections you guys want to see, if there's specific videos you guys want to watch, or if there's, you know, you know. I took on a lot of work this month. Why I did that, I will never know. I took on so much work. Like I, I have a few sponsorship things going on, which you guys already saw one. Um, there's one more coming to YouTube next week. And then there, everything has like deadlines, which I am glad to be able to do these. You guys know, I've been on YouTube since what, 2012? I don't even know how many years I've been on YouTube now. And I've probably done like literally maybe like seven sponsorships or something like that. Like, it's so few and far between. So I appreciate you guys being cool with it and I appreciate you guys like supporting me when I do them. If I do do them, know that it has taken a lot for me to like say yes to them. Um, I very picky about which ones I do. I wanna make sure that I love whatever product I'm promoting to you guys and that it's a good brand and it's reputable. And I've done a few on Instagram, but like YouTube, I'm very selective about what I do. You know, you rarely see like anything like that from me here, but I just wanted to let you guys know that's another reason I've been kind of MIA because I've been like working and meeting deadlines and stuff like that, which I, I actually really like doing. It keeps me accountable and it, it's, it's good. I know a lot of you guys are probably gonna ask about like the weight loss video because I have been promising that now. 
And of course I got the blood work results back. Everything's good there. So I can film the video anytime now. I wanted Zach to film it with me because we both done it. He's lost either the same amount or a little more than I have. And I feel at this point, like I really, really want to make the video. I have so much information I want to give you guys, but it's so much more than just a video. Like here's what I did. Here's how I lost the weight. You do it too. I want to like give disclaimers in there and be like, you know, you need to talk to your doctor because this may not work for you. This may not be right for you. Talk about the pitfalls of it. Like if you fuck up, here's what can happen. And I want people to listen to those things. And what's nerve wracking is if you just go into a video and you're like, here's how I lost weight. And then you just say it. People are going to blindly follow it. They might mess up and they might blame you for that. And I don't like that idea. I really want people to have all the facts and information before they go into anything because it's an amazing lifestyle that I'm doing. But at the same time, it can also, it has its problems if you don't do it right. And so I want to make sure that anyone who does it, does it right and gets the right information and knows the facts and has the sources and everything like that. So that's one of the main reasons I haven't, because I just frankly haven't had the time to put all that stuff together. There's kids screaming and they almost sound like they're having fun, but they almost sound like they're dying. Also, Avery started kindergarten, uh, was it last week? Um, it was like the ninth, maybe it was two weeks ago. Oh my God, I can't believe she's already been in school for that long. Oh my God. If that wasn't the most precious thing in the actual entire world. How do you feel? Good. Are you excited? Yeah. Oh my gosh. First day of school. Is that your backpack? Mm -hmm. Can I see it? Oh, it's a kitty with glasses. And a clock. And a clock? Mm-hmm. You got your little lunch bag in there? What about your folders? Yep. They're all in there? Yep. Okay. I don't need my ice pack. That's the bell. The bell. <laughs> Katie. <laughs> Seeing her all ready for school that morning and taking her to her first class and like her desk with her little name on it, I actually was crying in her school. They have this thing at her school too where it's like coffee and cry moment after you drop off your kindergartners, like after the first day of kindergarten. And so you all go to like the sweet little kids library and you go sit down and they had coffee and donuts and stuff. Of course, I didn't eat the donuts, but I would have loved to. Basically, you all just kind of cry about the fact that your baby is now grown up. And she's not my baby, you know, she's my niece, but still, she's my baby. Oh my God, it was so sweet. With her little backpack and her little school lunch and she loves getting hot lunch. And what's so cute is she she goes to the same school that I went to. So she's in the same elementary school that I was at and she is so tiny. This school is so small. When you're a little kid in a little school, it feels like a big school. But when I'm there and I remember being there at Avery's size, it just seems minuscule. They have not changed anything about this school since I went there 25 years ago. It is got the same carpet, the same library, the same classrooms. The teacher is so nice. The little students are precious. So I guess that's it. I just sometimes wanna not sit up in my makeup room with my crazy background and all that stuff. Like sometimes I just have too much going on. You guys get it, you're humans. You know what it's like. But it's nice to just be able to film a quick little video. It's funny because I was, I was actually thinking the other day and I was like, what did I used to upload to YouTube? Because now it's like reviews and you know, full face using this and doing this and all these different types of videos. And you guys really seem to love them. I love doing them too, they're so fun. But it's funny because I think, what the hell did I used to upload to YouTube? And I don't even know. Sometimes I look back, it's like the most random shit and it, there was no like structure to it. It was just random. So now when I do upload a random video like this, I feel so strange about it because it doesn't have any point. There's no point to it. It's not like, Today I'm reviewing Hobby Lobby plants. All right, well, I'm just gonna sit here and talk to you about bullshit and life. Life right now is pretty good. I've had some health issues here and there, but what is fucking new? I've definitely cured a lot of things, but also new things pop up every now and again. I was going through some really bad issues with my eyes. For some reason, they're seeming a little bit better now. I'm this bitch, okay? When I feel symptoms come on, I know my body better than anything in this world. I know when my, my shit's fucked up. And so I don't fuck around. If I feel something come on, I go to the doctor. And I did, I went straight to the doctor and nothing. Nobody has found anything, but I feel these weird symptoms and I'm not crazy. My eyesight's a little better now, but all this stuff's been going off at the same time, which is why I've just kind of been flighty and off of YouTube. But I feel, I've, I've been uploading. I haven't actually missed any uploads, so I'm like saying I've been flighty, but like I, I've been uploading, so I don't really, 
I just wanted to, you know, chat with you guys a little bit and talk about stuff that wasn't makeup because there's a lot more stuff going on in my life than makeup. I cannot wait for Halloween. I hope you guys are as excited as I am. It's gonna be legit this year. Way more legit than in previous years, you guys. Each video is like... I hope you guys love them so much and I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. And my camera died. <laughs> but thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. I love you guys so much and I will see you at my next video. Bye!